Hello and welcome back for some Mountain Blade. We are still very much in the early game, so my goal for this episode is to do some looting and some leveling. The two L's of gaming. I'll try to do a little bit less gaming in the game. Uh, gambling I mean, sorry. And I might even try to do some quests and get some leveling in order but we still have yeah we have no coal okay so the smithing part i will skip for now and i will go around and see if i can do some trading it has been a while since i played so i don't remember the best trade routes i knew that onira this city was pretty much terrible at everything This wood is not too bad, and I think this... Okay, I'm I'm already looking at the wrong part. Okay, this wood is pretty expensive. Grain is also pretty expensive. I'm still buying one or two, just so we can feed our people, and then we move on. Good thing is, we are such a small troop that we are still pretty fast. I'm not trying to recruit too much. Manual labors is not a quest that interests us greatly, and I think we're just fighting those Still looters right over there. here. Stop right there. Yes, yes. On my command! Let's give them some arrows to their faces. Which is the natural state of the looter. If I could hit their faces at all. Standing around is bad if they start throwing their stones. We are doing some damage, he's coming. I think my little companion over there is as good as that. But those looters are as well. I can line up my shots nicely if they start running at me with this low speed. Yeah, my wood runner is, is dead. But I should have enough ammo but if i'm standing around and uh, let them throw stones at me i might as well die okay now i need to be careful i mean i'm expecting to lose this run quite early but i'm not expecting to lose it to a few looters Okay, they are out of ammo. That was much closer than I, it had any right to be. As I said, I'm not used to playing on realistic difficulty. I'm I'm a, a peasant scrub, as some of you might say. So this is way out of my league. Which you might notice by me having trouble with some looters, but we did it. Just almost died. Okay, we showed those six looters. Who's boss? I'm not taking any prisoners. I don't want to be... I don't want to be slower than I have to be. No new armor for us, but we get a fish. Yes. Okay, we are overweight. So we drop a grain. But, as I said, looting and leveling. The leveling part is going great so far. Okay, we can choose a new perk. Movement speed penalty while reloading or armor penetration. Sorry, that has to be armor penetration. Uh, then our riding perk is either full speed, which gives us more charge damage, or a nimble steed, which gives us more maneuvering. Charge damage for my troops would be nice, but maneuvering is probably better in my opinion. I might 
take some bad, make some bad decisions over here, feel free to correct me in the comments. I, not, not that I can do anything about it. I don't think there's a respec button yet. Doesn't seem like there is. Okay, since I'm quite hurt, you know what I will do. As always, it was an honor. Let's see what I have to trade for us. We probably need a new pack animal. Mule this time, so we have some capacity. They also have pretty cheap grain. The clay is looking pretty cheap, but it's such a cheap good. I don't know if it's worth even getting. They have a lot of salt, which we can sell at Yelmaris for 73, so I'll take like 5 salt, need to do some trading. We could recruit a few troops. How's my speed looking? 5.2 because I'm hurting. So I even need some truth. Now we're at 5.8. Okay, that's much better. I need to be fast or otherwise the looters can just catch me. Now we will wait here for some time. We are good on health. Let's head out. This castle is under attack. There's 8 looters, but I'm so low on health. I don't even want to take on those 8 looters. I really need some better armor. Let's see how much our salt is selling for. <laughs> There's even cheaper salt here. It's going great. Let's buy some more salt. A hunter. A hunter horse, which is better than my horse. And a better horse means I can move faster and I die slower. And dying slower is everything I want. Okay, we can even look at some armor over here. That'd be a good armor, but way too expensive. The most important is body armor, probably. I'll get some cheap, cheap shoulder armor. And some cheap inf uh, breast armor. Yeah, this one is cheap and much better than what I have now. I don't have any protection for my hands. So let's get this one. Okay, 1500. That is... I can live with that. Okay, those looters are in my way. And now we move to Yelmaris. I'll speed this up a bit. Okay, we didn't even make it to Yelmaris because I get 91 for my sold over here. That is quite a hefty profit. I'm gonna sell like half of it. There is a tournament though. And we get a cataphract lens if we win. That seems worth it. I mean, the chance that we win is pretty low, but let's try, nonetheless. 
Okay. That is perfect. No one triggered to me. So let them fight it out. And then we take the winner on. Okay, I think we are doing some backstabbing. Was a bad hit. Okay, nice. First round. I just need to be in the top two. So if two teams kill each other, that would be perfect because even if I get knocked out, I'm still the next round. And I think from then on it was one we once. I know not the, the most honorable strategy I'm choosing here, but honor doesn't get me my cataphract lands. Okay, maybe my guy can do it. No, it doesn't look like it. Yep, he dead. Another quite bad hit. Okay, we have him. Okay, we are in the one we won stage. How confident am I in myself? I think I'm pretty confident, so we start the betting. This is a crossbow man after all. He shouldn't be good with a sword. Also nice to see my old strategy of just uh, hitting one side over and over and walking around and is still working. Now we are in a 1v1 for the grand prize. Can we do it? Let's find out. My only problem is that I'm really so slow with a sword. Oh, he baited me. We're doing next to no damage. I don't think this is going good. Okay, my shield is gone. Oh no! <laughs> I didn't trust in myself. Next time. We just need some one-handed skill. We, we just swing this sword way too slow. Okay, I already checked the trading prices. I'm just going to quickly make back my money. Couldn't help myself. Okay, checking the villagers for some quests. Landlord needs access. Extortion by deserters. Deserters are not something I want to get my hands on. A tournament? Yes, we have a tournament. Leather armor. Okay. Next try. I mean, we can't die here. Oh no. no okay. No. Not shoot me. Okay, 2v2. We need to help our guy. But he looks like a scrub lord. This is not going to be nice. Okay. Oh, we did it. Now for the archer.
Okay, nice. Never go by looks, apparently. Okay, another 2v2. Okay. And now, for the grand finale, we have to kill our friend. One hit. Two hits, one more, three hits. We did it. First tournament. And we gained some leather armor. Let's hope it is better than what we currently have. And I think we got a perk in athletics. Okay, plus plus three percent combat movement speed and plus five percent combat movement speed to troops in my formation, or five hit points and five hit points to troops in my formation. So five percent hit points or three percent movement speed. Since we're on a horse most of the time, I take the hit points. Also, I think five. Hit points to all my people in my in my foot troops for my foot troops is also quite nice. Okay, we also have an attribute point and we have a new focus point. The focus point I will probably put into scouting and the attribute point into cunning. Okay, let's check our leather armor. It is quite a bit better than what we currently have, so I'll take it. And to celebrate, no, 11 loot, this is a bit much. I think we recruit one or two soldiers before we engage them. Yes, some noble recruits, why not? Okay, come here, looters. Mess with us. Yeah, yeah, I will mess with you. Okay, 11 looters. Under my command. Oh no, we fight in a, in a settlement. Let's just tell my people to go. Where are they? Over there. Okay, running at them, quite risky, since they are throwing stones after all. But if I distract a few of them, my, my guys have a better chance of actually fighting them. And since we have better armor now, their stones are looking a bit less, less daunting. We might even train some pole arms if we can hit them. Since we're a professional Bannerlord player almost, we can hit them easily. And we did it. I think we only lost one guy. Yes, one guy and one wounded. As one dead, one wounded. Could be worse. Yeah, we take the loot. Thank you. It was almost something like actual gameplay.
let's head up to the Batanians and see how they are doing. Lots of noble recruits. Sadly, Imperial noble recruits. I want some Batanian noble recruits. And holy moly, there's a lot of them. I want all of them. We are a bit slower right now. More noble recruits. Hell yeah. More noble... Okay. Yeah, that's, those are normal peasants. Okay, let's fight some forest bandits. Not too many. Okay, let's look at Dunglandis. Maybe they want some olives. Yes, they do want some olives. They have pretty cheap grain for me and normally they also have pretty cheap wood. No, this is the wrong city. I know what I'm talking about. Okay, a tournament for a horse. Sadly, the Batanian tournaments are not my forte, since a lot of the fights are two-handed and I basically go down in one swing. So I will probably lose a 1v1 later on, but let's see about that one. Okay, let's see who's boss over here. He is, he is. Yeah, that's what I was talking about, 106 plant damage. That's the problem with me being small. They hit my head much better. Oh, that hurt one. Okay, yeah. He did me dirty. Yes, yes. First time we're getting a bit of a bigger battle, just because the faction leader of the Batanians, Mr. Kellerdog over here, joined me. So I don't think we will see too much loot. Oh, we even killed one. Nice. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Uh, one looter down. Now we can cut some of the fleeing looters down. Didn't even lose one. Very nice.
we get a pole arm perk. Nice. Rugged scale armor. I'll just try. I mean. Yeah, okay. So much for that. Can my guy do it? No. Nighttime or day try daytime traveling speed. I don't know what the consensus is about this. I'm just taking the nighttime one. The bonus is bigger, but nighttime is much shorter. Oh, and we get another main quest over here. Why is Why are the sturgeons over here? Like deep in empire territory. I wanna talk to them, they won't let me. Okay. We've got no quarrel with you. Okay, I'll take the gamble and this time I'll auto resolve it. Yeah, and I lost a high bond youth. So that's why I'm That's why I'm always a bit how do you say I, I don't want to auto resolve because I know that stuff like this happens in auto resolve. No fight in the arena. So what better way to end this episode? <laughs>